Hello everybody, Alicia the Hun here, and welcome back to West of Loathing. I've really enjoyed this game thus far, and I hope you guys have too, so let's continue on! Alright. Sorry, I have a small head. My headphones aren't fitting right from the Christmas ad. Alright. Continue. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, I think I can fix the guy now, maybe. Let's see. Try to fix him. Oh, I still don't have a lockpick. I have to go buy one. Alright, get a lockpick. We'll get a lockpick. <coughs> Hello, sir. Give me a lockpick. Lockpick, lock. Ah, oh, shit. There's no lockpicks in here. Alright. Alright, let's go, Jeff. My name is Jeff. Saddle up. Alright, so... Went to the graveyard. Let's... Let's go to... I'm, go I'm going to a ranch because there's going to be lockpicks there. Okay, you come acro across the corpse of a cowboy. How do you know it's the corpse of a cowboy? Well, you see by his outfit that he is a cowboy. And you see by his lack of flesh that he is a corpse. You know what? Let's give him an honorable burial. You dig up, you dig a grave and put the cowboy's remains in it. Awesome. First aid too. All right, I'm going through these. Yes, I need that. I need that. I definitely need this. Okay, there are still some beans in in this pot. Okay, grabbed it. Oh, all of the books on this shelf are burned. But you notice something strange about the back of the shelf. You deaf fingers find a hidden hatch, and the back panel of the shelf slides away to reveal a secret compartment. There's a book inside Mary Stern's Diary. Awesome! Mine now. Toy box contains a single object a creepy burnt pur purslane. Porcelain. Sorry, porcelain doll. <laughs> it's the work of a, it's the work of a, of a moment to fix the doll's voice box. Pull the string. You pull the string, the doll's eyes roll back into its head, and its mouth begins to move. Ugh, I hate dolls, guys. I really do. <laughs> Hi, I'm Grace. What's your name? I'm Maud. Hi, Maud. You're nice. Do you want to play with me? Yes, let's play. Hooray! Mary used to play with me, but we didn't get to finish our tea party before she went away. Will you help me finish it? Surely. Hooray! The game is almost over. Mary did such a good job. The doll rolls its eyes backward. Back forward. Oh, back forward. Ugh. <clears throat> Go downstairs and get me, get my cup. Do you know the magic word to make the mean cow let you into the secret room? No, what is it? The magic word is peanut butter. The doll goes silent. Got it, peanut butter. You shudder as you realize that talking dolls haven't been invented yet, spooky. Okay. Where's the basement? Oh, pick lock. You pick the lock and open the box. Oh, a document. You got a stock certificate. Well, let's see if I can read my stuff that I got here. 
Read it. Wait, didn't I already read this? Yeah, I did read that. Okay, hold on. Da -da 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 -da. I got this one. Read it. The first page says, in a little girl's handwriting, this is the diary of Mary Stearns, the... <coughs> a... And the A in diary are crossed out and the Aya written above them. The diary starts out as typical kid stuff. You flip ahead until you notice the writing's getting shakier. Found a doll under a cactus out back and she told me her name was Grace. Mama and Papa don't believe me that she talks. They say I got a big imagination. Grace says the cows are gonna get us, but Papa s says, well, we'll be okay, cause this weren't never a cow ranch. Grace says he's wrong, but Papa won't believe me. Grace says she can keep the cows away, but I have to play tea party with her. Keep reading. I don't like this kind of tea party, but Grace says it's important to keep the cows away. Mama was sad that they couldn't find Effie. Papa said she's been gone so long, and they should put a, a cross up, but Mama won't let him, because she thinks she'll come back. Papa said she's only 11. How far could she have gone? And Mama started crying again. Don't want to play tea party anymore, but Grace says I, I has to. Keep reading. Papa has two, out to, two days looking for Joey, but of course he didn't find him. Mama cries so much. I tried to tell her him and Effie are helping keep the cows away, but she don't understand. I told Grace I'm not playing in tea party again, but she says I gotta, and if I don't, cows will eat all three of us. She said either I get Mama or Papa to play, or else I gotta play by myself. Last entry. That's the last entry. Uh, I don't know about going to the basement for this, this thing. Let's see if I can find anything else. Oh, I can't even harvest that. Oh, between the smoke and the noise, you're guessing that the continents of this outhouse are more dangerous than the average outhouse con contents. Oh! I thought we, I had to say peanut butter. Oh, never mind, I guess. Shoot! Shoot! You got this, Doc. Ah, oh, well, this cow isn't so bad. Well, I got it. I'm victorious. That house out, outhouse now is safe as houses, outhouses. By the soft light of fading embers, you see a glint of light from below. You hold your nose with one hand as you fish out your prize with the other. Toilet pistol, hooray. Can I switch? Yeah, I can totally switch this out. Toilet pistol it is. Yeah, toilet pistol. There we go. It's a stinky toilet gun. But it's my stinky toilet gun. Oh, what's this? Pick it. Got it. Smoking. Whatever it's smoking. Looking like Gerald's bones were dug up by some vermin or another. Search him. Ah, yeah. Charge lock it. I was wanting one of those. Okay. Well. Gotta get past this cow. Peanut butter. Uh, atop this sinister looking altar sits a, a copper goblet filled with what appears to be blood. I'm gonna destroy this goblet. You don't know what this is, but you 
No, it's a bot. Abominable. You grab the goblet and smash it against the altar. Everywhere, the blood lands. Cracks appear. The altar groans as it crumbles into ruins. Yeah, I beefed up. Good. I got, I got rid of that. You need to go. There's still some food on the shelf. Grab it. Okay, what did I get? Cat's eye candy, jellied escargot. And some sugar guns. Oh, I can't crack this safe. Okay. Well, I guess that's all that's is here. Alright, guys. Well, oh, wait, hold on before I do this. I gotta make sure the doll's not talking anymore. Hold on. Take it out. Grace eyelids glow red. She must know what you did. You'll live to regret this. Ha ha ha. Her mouth snaps shut and her eyelids close. Well, that's only a little bit on ominous. Alright. Since it seems we we uncurse this place now. Uh, I hope you liked this episode. And, uh, you know, if you like to press the like button, and if you didn't press the dislike button, please leave comments. Comments are awesome, man. And if you're not subscribed, remember to subscribe to my channel and press that little bell icon to get notified. I also have a Twitter. It's at Alicia the Hun. Same thing as me. All right. Well, peace out, bros. Bye-bye.